Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. We're trying Deep Rock Galactic Survivor. Now I kind of have sworn off this genre mostly because I find that just about every single entry to it contributes very little in terms of novelty or much change to the genre. It is more or less the same thing over and over again with some exceptions of course, um, but this is a different case. It's you know, the deep rock galactic devs, and they have thrown their hats in the ring. And I wanted to see, um, you know, are they contributing? Are they doing something? Are they changing something? Are they innovating? Or is this going to be a deep rock galactic skin on vampire survivors? Uh, that might sound like super critical, but I mean, I I'm coming in with a cynical eye in this case. I want to know. So I've been uh, fortunate enough to get into the playtest, and I would like to see for myself, and I am going to uh, show you as long as and I, I've seen nothing that uh, suggests uh, suggest that I'm not able to show off anything. Um, there's nothing said that there's much of an embargo or anything. So I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna play this. We'll see we'll see how it is. Deep Rock Galactic. We've got upgrades. We've got not artifacts. We've got milestones. All right, we're gonna forgo. Kill aliens. So, um, you know, it's Deep Rock Galactic. We're, we're mining, we're mining gold as, as one does, and uh, from that gold, we are collecting stuff, and we are getting your level up pop-ups. Now, I have actually um, vocalized some displeasure in the genre's insistence on having the pop-ups like constantly interrupt your game. I feel like there's got to be some kind of compromise. So. Um, XP gain or mining speed increases how fast you can mine rocks. Sure. This is, uh, I don't know. I'm not going to you know, hold it against. It. I mean, it's a staple, but, uh, okay. So I was just thinking like, uh, do I have to mine or like, how do I attack? Is, it seems to be that my dude auto attacks. So we have, this is an auto attacking vampire survivor game. I mean, everything kind of really does look like deep rock galactic and it really does look like vampire survivors so far 35 percent damage increased weapon level i mean a lot of and I, and I don't know of a lot of people but you know some people might call me out um like you know you know what you're getting into you know exactly what you're jumping into so why why complain about it well it's not i'm not complaining just yet um i'm willing to you know see this through but i guess for me i'm a little bit disappointed that um you know we've we've agreed on a couple of you know things a couple of mechanics uh and basically the genre has out you know again out of outside of a couple of games refused to grow refused to change much um and i mean like you know there's it's it's vampire survivors with paper airplanes it's vampire survivors with i don't know uh paint brushes actually that one actually kind of looks pretty good if you don't know what i'm talking about there's a semi bullet heaven or whatever genre name we've agreed on um version with paint brushes that were like painting a canvas sure uh it looks it looks pretty good um i liked uh snurks i can't remember exactly what it was called but i, I feel like snurks was more of a drafting game and i think that uh, there is some drafting mechanics in vampire survivors i actually think that that i would argue that that is um most of the appeal I know that a lot of people would say, well, it is, of course, the uh, eye candy of it. The eye candy actually, for me, kind of turns me away. It's part of what stops me playing these games long term because it's just like a lot. Like at a certain point, I can't even look at the game because it is so much going on. And maybe, maybe it's a skill issue. I don't care status effect damage or increased reload speed let's take the reload speed i see we can also re-roll if we want i'm supposed to be collecting more kit i just noticed that we have a goal in the top right corner and we have bosses can we like do anything like do we have a uh, my control key is sticking um we've got some more kit over here let's go get that i mean i do like that the level is limited and I know that a lot of Vampire Survivors games, the levels are technically limited, but they certainly feel unlimited. You really do have to go in one direction for 
uh, like 20 minutes sometimes before you actually see the end of, uh, of the level. I really just want to get that market, but, uh, it's proving to be quite, quite the tough nut, nut to crack. I wish that bug would die. Okay, we've got 15 more kits. Right, we got, we got artifacts. You get a small chance to find XP when mining any kind of rock. You get a small chance to find nitra when mining any kind of rock. I wonder if we have, like, ammo in this game. Like, I know we have to reload, but I wonder if we have limited ammo. Collecting red sugar increases your max HP. That's kind of interesting. Um, sure. Uncommon. I mean, I guess those uh, other two are rare. New Bosco weapon. Fire a barrage of rockets that damages other uh, random enemies. Sure. Uh, it seems to me we are being directed to leave in 22 seconds. Maybe not leave. I, I'm, I'm very much thinking in, like, Deep Rock Galactic terms. Um, so there's the ending, but I really want to get that market. There we go. We got it. Increase fire rate or pick up radius. Sure, pick up radius. I'm, I'm gonna leave. Is that the end? Oh, I see. There's five stages. Interesting. Um, loosen bolts. So we, we have different, uh, upgrades that we need different currencies for. Luckily, the, the one I would probably go for is the one I can afford right now we could also re-roll for some currency but i'm not gonna do that okay so we have uh levels i won't say that that is like super novel but it is something okay, i'm trying to remember i think it was called neophyte was one of my favorite vampire survivors and it was barely a vampire survivor because it actually added quite a lot of like mobility and skill to it not that these games are not completely devoid of skill but i have noticed that a lot of survivor games will kind of skirt the edge like they'll make it just easy enough that you can progress without um doing much and i mean like the more skills and stuff you add to a game the more or the, the easier it's going to be for the player to progress and therefore the more likely they're going to be to like hit that dopamine button like 16 more times so i think that there is an incentive to make these games seem like they're challenging when really they are uh you know more or less uh they're they're i don't know how to put it a stacked deck let's see but hey i mean we've got lots of stuff going on here i could i could be eating my words here and you know i must i must be i, I should have said and i should underline that this game is early so it could be that, you know, a lot of innovation and interesting mechanics are planned for this game in the future. And I, I think for a lot of people, as long as it fits the genre and does what is on the tin, which is, hey, I want to play a survivor game with the Deep Rock Galactic uh, look, then, you know, look no further. You have your wish has been granted. Here it is. Um, you know, enjoy. And, uh, you know i have some problems with that but i don't think that that's necessarily like a problem does that make sense i'm gonna collect these mushrooms i think uh, i think one of the something that like i guess gave me i won't say hope because that it sounds like i'm now in despair but um i i did have hope that this game was going to be a little bit more um was that it has a playtest and i mean like why do a playtest unless you're trying something a little bit different i don't know maybe there's lots of good reasons we'll see i'm gonna i do i mean we're digging through walls that's that is something in order to avoid enemies i did just dig through a big chunk of cave so that's kind of cool that's something i haven't seen before um am i supposed to be hitting the two button occasionally or does it have a, like a varying range i'm, I'm still looking for more uh, mushrooms i also I, I do know i have played some deep rock galactic i know i should collect some of this red stuff so i can recover my health let's do that let's collect some of this business but i i really am uh, looking for some more um mushrooms i haven't really explored this area oh what's that 
Ooh, what is that though? I really don't seem to be able to kill anything anymore. So we've reached that stage where I either, I guess I either um, leveled up enough or I didn't. Or um, in in my viewpoint, uh, we've reached the meta, meta uh, progression cap. Where it's like, I, you know, if I die a few times and, 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 you know, increase our upgrades, then I will have gotten past this part. We are leveling up still. Let's increase our damage. Maybe that'll give me a bit more potential here. This is not looking good. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. It's looking real bad, actually. Just want that mushroom. We got the things from Half-Life. They almost killed me. Yo, can you kill the little dude, please? It seems like uh, even the little guys have become so strong that I, I can't kill them anymore. Kill the elite Macera. Oh, I'm dead. All right, well, time to go and click the upgrade button a couple of times so that I will feel stronger. If you can't tell, um, my cynicism is growing. If you couldn't tell, it is growing. Reach rank two on scout. We've got a new weapon. I don't mind new weapons. I like replayability. What I mind is this. I, I, I mind it a great deal. Um, what I'm going to do, let's see here. Do we have enough to, no, we don't have enough for, okay. I guess the ones that we have are highlighted. And so that's all we could afford. So I uh, back into the fray. I'm surprised I didn't get anything else. We didn't get any artifacts. We did get a milestone. It's time, miner. Find the and so, I mean, like at this point, you are going to know if the game is for you or not. Like, it's straight up. Level pickup radius. Fire rate, critical damage. Let's do... I should have re-rolled that, honestly. None of those were good. I mean, I like leveling up. I like uh, picking new power-ups. I, I guess uh, I didn't have to pick too many level-ups. But maybe is that a good thing or a bad thing? Did I, did I um, you know, fail to kill enough stuff? Maybe instead of focusing on gold, I should be focusing on killing things. So that I can progress quickly. Fire rate seems like a good one to increase. That's health right there. We don't need that. Maybe something, uh, maybe, maybe the reason I don't think that uh, Vampire Survivors is a skill issue kind of game is because I spend a lot of time exploring and not actually like just killing things and leveling up. New weapon. Let's try a new, new weapon. Voltic, Voltaic Stun Sweeper. Let's try that. We've got a electric boomerang. I mean, that's novel. I have seen that before, but you know, it's, it's cool. I like that. That reload is, is kind of a bummer, but I, I, I get it. Oh, that, uh, that does some nice damage. All right, let's increase our move speed. I, I think definitely I like to go glass cannon with these kind of games. I mean, you know, they, they I think it's easy to suss out why because like you know if you're ever in a situation where you're taking damage you're probably going to die anyway so i don't really see the point in making you know giving yourself too much of a survivability unless it's like a skill game in which you're like dodging around and there's there's ways to mess up as a as a player we could do critical damage i don't think that critical damage was really a good idea Unless we get uh, another weapon that, like, has an increased fire rate. Critical damage in fire rate or, you know, match made kind of thing. Uh, damage, reload speed. Let's just do damage. Let's beat up this rock until I get the banana nuggets. Bismore. Collect alpaca. Alpaca blooms. I know that um, Deep Rock Galactic has a very, very passionate fan base. Um, I've, I've never been like the biggest fan of Deep Rock Galactic, but I, I do respect it. I think it's, it is a good game. Fire rate. Increase weapon level. Or plus three. That seems to me that this, this one is just like straight up better. I guess this is increased fire rate for all weapons, whereas this is only for the one weapon. Either way, I will increase it for that one weapon. 
All right, so now we have to kill the elite bug. I'm already starting to feel like I'm not killing things as quickly as I should be. I really want to break that and get the banana nuggets. And then, uh, oh God, we can make it. Let's get that. I still, I want to get all the alpaca blooms. I'm pretty sure the only thing that, um, like prompts the end of the level is, uh, killing the elite. So as long as we don't kill the elite, we can achieve our sub goal. We need more health. I'm going to go have to get some of that, those red nuggies. Oh, there's our last alpaca, but it's kind of, we're, we're kind of playing this a little bit too close to the line here. Bosco take leaks cryo uh, fluid, slowing all enemies with range. Deals cryo damage. 10 per plus 10 percent reload speed. Fire a barrage of rockets that damages. Um, hmm. I guess those are two. Those are both Bosco upgrades. Sure. Let's get some Bosco upgrades. No, the gold is actually slowing me down. No. Oh. I need health. Give me that health. Nice. And uh, Bosco is, is giving me that uh, cryo business. I kind of wish, like, I don't think I'm really doing anything. Like, I don't even think having the mouse on the screen is, there is any point to it. Because, like, my dude is auto firing. I'm pretty sure I'm auto mining as well. Yeah, I'm just like auto mining. So like, there's no, there's not, like I'm not really doing any, anything except dodging around and like picking my direction. Supplies are on the way. Nice. Collecting red sugar increases your max HP. I think I picked that last time or did I pick something else? You get a small chance to find nitro when mining any kind of rock. You get a small chance to find gold when mining any kind of rock. Let's take that. The last one didn't really serve me that well. Okay, well, we definitely want to get out of here. I'm just going to go ahead and tank. Increases the damage bonus of a critical hit. Nah, let's just do fire rate. I'm not sure if we get um, the pickups if I leave. I'm assuming no. Okay, so fast little legs. More HP. Mining speed. Well, we can take more than one, so let's take max HP. I'm one away from getting that last one. I can, can I level this up? Is that a thing I can do? Why does it have a up, up button? Heal. Mm. Well, I'm not sure. Increase weapon level. Don't know if I can do that. If there's a button there that tells me I can do that, then I don't know what it is. One thing I do think is different, and uh, I'm just going to go ahead and check this right now, is I'm pretty sure that this game is going to have multiplayer, and I think it will be the first one to offer that. It says so far, it says right now single player. Um, four playable characters. Finished will contain more of every type of content as well as other features all to be determined. Is this game not going to have multiplayer? I feel like it would be something you could definitely do. Single player survival auto looter. I would have thought that one of the best reasons to do a Deep Rock Galactic survivor game would be to include multiplayer. Uh, maybe I'm like off base. Maybe someone can correct me in the comments. I'd appreciate that. Um, but like, that's very strange if, if the case. Because then like, what is really making this stand out from others of its ilk, you know? I'm starting to feel that wall again. I'm not doing very much damage right now. I need another weapon. I need I need to level up. I'm not getting level up very quickly. And um, I feel like maybe the speed in which you level up drops off just a little bit too quickly. And it uh, it, it can lead you to just like stall completely 
I mean, we, we can't, like, we get XP from, from mining, so there's no reason why I shouldn't mine. Oh. This is in the cryo stuff is actually helping quite a good quite a good deal And that uh, electric boomerang does some really good spread damage I just want to I want to level get give me them give me them jewels Okay, reload speed reload speed reload speed. They really want me to have reload speed. I'm gonna reroll that Reload speed. Um, fire rate. Thank you. Yeah, that's a. I'm starting to, you know, see that has a bit more pep now. I haven't even been collecting like my main juice here. The, the alpaca blooms again. Ouch. Getting getting through that rock, that deep rock business. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm feeling the, I'm feeling it, Mr. Krabs. I, I, I think that this is, is feeling, it's feeling very samey, I won't lie. It's feeling like very much the game I've played for the last year. Give me that. Give it to me. What is that? Anor Pearl. That's kind of nice. What does that do for me? Can't remember if this is the stuff that revives my health. I think it is. No, it's not. I think this is Nitra. I think in the game, doesn't that give me more ammo? Or it lets me spawn more ammo? In the game. This is, of course, the movie. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Kill aliens. I guess if I kill three, 300 aliens, then... The elite spawns. I'm starting to suss out how this the format works here. Um, I really need health. Where is all the health? Oh god. Oh my god. I just where is all the health? Thank god I have the increased uh, mining speed. No, no. Yo, where is all the health though? Oh, I'm dead for sure. How am I still alive? Okay, there we go. Yeah, I don't know. Um, this is, this is unfortunately sitting very uncomfortably in that, uh, in that little spot that that bugs me about these games is I, I just like I don't have enough to really engage me other than uh, the visuals and um, like in this case I'm, I'm not able to level up quickly enough to really keep up with um, with the game I still can't uh, level up my damage really where is damage what do we need for that we need some pickle we need a pickle juice it's the, the, the funniest thing I've ever seen. I, I increase your XP gain. I mean, like, I it's just uh, it's never not gonna bother me. <laughs> like it really is. Like this, the, the very thing I'm complaining about right now, which is, um, I don't, I'm not leveling up quickly enough, is literally something I can level up. It's like okay, so I, I just, I should just die. Um, I should just like go into the level, pick up some stuff, and then die. And I mean, these games feel already like very much like they're, they're kind of offering the illusion of player agency. I know I'm ripping in. I, I don't mean to rip into this specific game. I'm kind of getting a lot of like vampire survivor rant stuff off my chest right now. But like it, it's it's just like in, in a way for me, this is kind of the final nail in the coffin. I, I get a, I won't say I get a lot of requests to cover games, but more often than not these days, it's vampire survivor clones and I can't do it anymore. <laughs> unless a game really has something to show for itself, unless it's like really trying to do something very new and novel with, with the format, I really just can't do this anymore. 
it's the fidget spinner thing all over again now it's, it's you know nothing wrong with fidget spinners i suppose shoots high caliber okay so this is the gun i unlocked let's see if this is any good I know it's like really gonna sound bad, but at a certain point the the vampire survivor Format starts to feel like the indie equivalent of a cash grab Change the damage type to electrical. Okay, sure do that. I mean, I don't get very many level ups So let's go ahead and waste one on make it electrical. I'm not sure what that's gonna do for me Just give me this gold. I don't care Give me the gold XP gain no more damage, please we need to keep up with demands. I wonder, honestly, I, 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 here's, here's the, I guess the litmus test. I don't know if that's the right way, a phrase for it, but like if I took damage every single time I get a level and I try and get his level as much as I possibly can, picking up every single jewel, would I have enough damage to keep up with demands? And if the answer is no, and the answer is I, I had to get the upgrades between matches that's where i draw the line that's where oh wait medium weapons there's actually weapon types are they like offering me bonuses for weapon types that i don't have would they do that they wouldn't do that would they they wouldn't just go on the internet and 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 provide me with boosts for guns that i don't have would they no how do i check what kind of guns i have there's so little interaction i can't even interact with the ui I really didn't mean for this game to be the punching bag for a lot of complaints, but um, I do have some. I'm going to kill you all. Reload speed, reload speed. I can't imagine caring about reload speed. I mean, I know it's like, yeah, okay, there's like a good five seconds when I can't shoot the gun, but I'd rather just shoot faster when I can shoot. Affects Bosco's pea shooter. This charges a beam of electrical energy between you and Bosco damaging. Okay, well, we're already doing boss, uh, Bosco damage, electrical damage. So why not do more ele uh, electrical damage? There's the elite, by the way. And I don't even have half the mushrooms I need. Stop giving me reload speed. Good lord. Yeah, give me more damage. I'm going to kill the elite and I'm... I don't mean to really. Oh, there's some more mushrooms over there. Oh, well, I have 30 seconds now. Collecting red sugar. You get a small chance to find gold. You get a small chance to find XP. Okay, you know what? I mean, since I am complaining about not finding enough XP, let's try and fix that problem. I think I just completed my sub goal. Fire rate. Let's go for fire rate as much as possible. I kind of wish that, like, I, this is something I would just, like, recommend um, in terms for this game is that when you leave the level, you just get the stuff that is on the floor. It works that way for Botato, and I think it works well in that case. Uh, reload speed, more damage, which I can't afford. And status effect to damage, increases all damage over time from asset. Okay, well, I mean, that does actually synergize with my build right now. Shucks, if I get to level 3, then, I mean, uh, I really have nothing I can complain about, can I? I've set myself up for success in that regard. I'm really not ready for this. I see there's a skull on that 5th level, so I have to assume that means there's a, a big, big bad. Give me one second, yeah. Can, when, when do we get the pickle? That's not the pickle. That's Magnite. We're still collecting Bulu cap. Bulo co caps? Bulo caps. This is really gonna. This whole episode is gonna appear like that Steve Buscemi meme. Which is like, hello, fellow miners. Oh, that actually sounds a lot worse. 
out of context. Oh, good lord. All right. Stop spitting your acidy juices at me. Stop it. So yeah, here we're at that cap now where I'm, I'm not getting XP nearly as quickly as I was. But I am killing things faster, I will say. We want more Bulu caps. I mean, getting more Bulu caps would, in fact, level us up. It seems to give us quite a lot of stuff. Gems, rewards. That's not the, that's not the pickle. They keep not giving me the pickle. All right, well, um, I'm reaching that desperation point again, I think. I'm going to keep trying as best as I can. I'm looking for those Bulo caps. If I could get those Bulo caps, then I might stand a chance. Also, there doesn't seem to be any health on the field again. Increases the crit bonus, damage bonus of crit. No, let's just, you know, go for damage always. Oh, there's a Bulo cap. Ah, there's the last one. Last one. Yay. I didn't level off that. Hey, but there's a magnet. That might actually level me up. Yes. Throws a boomerang that returns to you. Voltaic stun sweeper. Targets. Close. Oh, that's electrical damage. That's the third weapon. Increases fire rate. Um, or max HP. Let's just continue doing fire rate. That's for the boomstick. Well, things are actually looking pretty okay right now, I will say. Give me that. Takes a long time for the jewel, like the XP jewels to land. And so you can like just they can just become inaccessible to you because now they're behind enemy lines. Please, please die. I want, I just, oh God, I'm going to die. I would like to get through this level. Oh, all right. Well, I died. That's going to do it for this, for this video. I think that you have seen, um, all that I need to show you. We did unlock the Thor bug taser. Loadout. Is there different loadouts? There might be a different loadout, but I think you only get access to the scout. Increased critical chance, higher move speed, increased dodge chance. And um, first aid kit increases your pickup radius, movement speed. I would probably, well, I would go for XP if I could. It's hilarious that I never did find the pickle, so I was never able to increase my damage. Regen. Oh, life regen. That seems like highly good. Pick up radius, smooth speed. I mean, yeah, let's just do all of those. Yeah, I mean, uh, consensus reads, I, um, it's, 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 it's a, it's a survivor's game. I, it looks nice. It looks pleasant. Um, I really don't think it contributes much in its current state. Uh, I think it's, more or less just a survivor's game with the deep rock galactic skin on it and uh maybe you'll like that um i don't think i do i think that uh there are other other games that contribute more to this game uh endless respect for the for deep rock galactic love love the game but uh you know i was i guess i was hoping or had expectations for more from this um maybe i'm off base on that you're totally welcome to disagree with me in uh, the comments but um i don't think you'll be able to change my mind on this unless there's something very obvious i'm mistaking or uh missing the obvious thing of course is that this game isn't finished yet but um in its current state i, I do think that it's it's missing a lot of features <laughs> um but in any case let me know what you think of it if you've played it if you've played the play test um, and if you enjoyed this video for what it's worth um definitely consider hitting the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.